If you have suffered from constipation, you know how miserable it can be. You feel sluggish, tired, and depressed, not to mention the discomfort in your abdomen. Of course, laxatives abound on the market, but they offer a temporary solution at best. In addition, they can create a dependency. Enemas are unpleasant. Surely there is a better way to get your colon clean and keep it that way. Adding insoluble fiber to the diet can help, but it basically only works to scrape out the material through the center of your clogged colon. It is not really a colon cleanser, because it does not clear out the old impacted fecal matter. It cannot really get your colon clean. It only helps to keep things moving. Many people have as much as 15 or 20 pounds of old fecal matter impacted on the walls of the colon. Fortunately, there is a way to melt away this matter from the small and large intestines as well as the colon. A good quality oxygen-based colon cleanser is one that consists of oxides and peroxides of magnesium that have been pressurized with oxygen. These chemical will release oxygen when they combine with the hydrochloric acid in your stomach. This type of colon cleanser actually turns that impacted hard matter that has been lodged in your digestive tract for a long time into a liquid or gas so that it can be eliminated from the body. The chemicals oxidize the material safely and effectively. Naturally this means that the bowel movements will be watery and gaseous for a while. This is not actually diarrhea, but a result of the oxidation. When you do a colon cleanse with an oxygen-based product, it is wise to stay near a bathroom for a day or so. It is also helpful to drink a lot of water. Of course, drinking water is good for treating constipation anyway, but much water alone won't clean out the colon. However, it will help flush out the watery, gaseous stools resulting from the cleanse. The amount of water recommended is half your body weight in ounces. For instance, if you weigh 160 pounds, you will want to drink 80 ounces of water each day. This is the equivalent of 10 cups. Or 2 and a half quarts. Conventional wisdom recommends 2 quarts of water a day for everyone, but most people don't even drink this much consistently. Larger people will benefit from drinking even larger amounts of water. The colon cleanse might make you feel like you have diarrhea, but true clinical diarrhea results from a bacterial agent like E. coli or other water or food contaminants. It can also be the result of a disease of the intestines, such as irritable bowel syndrome. Celiac disease, a condition in which you don't tolerate eating wheat and other gluten grains, can also cause diarrhea.